Take a jump now. Okay, I got. <laughs> I I know I keep doing that. I gotta stop starting the episode with taking a dump. Everybody, everybody gets so annoyed at me when I keep saying that, and it's hilarious. At this point, I'm gonna just keep doing it because it makes me laugh and it makes everybody else upset. <laughs> so yeah. Anyways, we got a cutscene. Oh, you're back. Wow, just poof, poof the ant berries out of existence. Great job sharing up some ant berries for me. With a supply like this, our problem should be over. I can't carry it all. Could you stack it over there? Yeah. Yes. Very good. Now that I have ant berries, it's off to treat my patients. <laughs> Woo. Those poor people who got hit with Gloom can finally be cured. I do still worry a bit about Bowser Jr., though. Bowser's minions are annoying, but it's not like I want Zacket to win, either. Well, we don't want either of them to win. <laughs> yeah, it's like three wars. Or, well, not three wars. It's like three armies going against each other, you know? One of them has got to come out on top, and it's gonna be me, Mario's army! What was that noise? There's big trouble! Is it Zocket? Ooh! Oh, there's this fucking, like, crazy-ass fortress. Man, he means business. He's got a fucking, like, gloam tornado up there. What? What is that? I've seen that thing before. It's the fortress that was fighting Bowser's minions. Everything is in place. Are we here in Zocket? Then that must be. Take a good look. Enough gloom has been connected. Or collected. <laughs> His time is nigh. This is the dawn of a truly isolated world. What the hell? Zaka's fortress. It can only be one thing. Fortress Socket. Huh? Now she's putting words in a different order. <laughs> this this sounds a bit more like um. Yoko music. <laughs> what do you mean a truly isolated world? Ant berries can cure Gloam, right? Gloam is only part of this scheme. I can't predict where this is headed, but Fortress Zocket will play a role. There must be something in there to dominate the world through isolation. Zocket said something about his time. Yes. Something worse than Zocket is about to awaken. Oh shit, really? In Fortress Zocket. He's trying to he's trying to like resurrect a god or something? Uh, that's typical, isn't it? Then we must do something about that fortress. Oh, yeah. yeah, I will do it. But how do we get there? Mario Luigi! I know you must have got a lot on your minds, but I found the new current. Wow. Oh! And I think that current will get us right to the Great Lighthouse Island. If we light up the Great Lighthouse, maybe it'll show us where to go. Yes! It seems the sound is option at the moment. I agree, it's worth trying. Okay. This is even more remarkable than I imagined. <clears throat> I think this might come in handy. Here you go. You got the auto amp berry plug. If you want more amp berries, simply come speak to me. As long as it's just a few, I'm happy to share with you. Okay. And this one's from me. 
You got the anti zogget specialist. Oh, yeah, like the anti, um... Well, we already had the anti gloam specialist and the anti minion specialist, so why not anti zogget I made this plug based on data the idle kids gathered on Zocket soldiers. This is the result of a lot of effort. I'm sure it'll come in very handy. We want to be useful, so we'll keep investigating. Idle crew, hit the seas! <laughs> what was that Klonoa ass voice? <laughs> Ooh, we got side quests? Well, there's a lot of these, actually. Um... There's a slip and glide resident who hates the cold. Okay, slip and glide. Supposedly there's a mysterious fortune teller on ship shape. Maybe she can tell you if you're actually cursed or not. There's a fortune teller here? Um, the toads that were aboard ship shape apparently debarked. Debarked? <laughs> That's a word. For off and an island. What's going on? What's going on over there? And, um... Colorful sea foes return to the Great Lighthouse stronger than before. Hear what do we fight him has to say. Oh shit, are we gonna get we gonna have another X boss? Uh he's not over here. I keep forgetting that he's here. Anyways, let's get prepared for let's get this current opened up real quick. Oh, Mario, Luigi, something bad's going on. Crescendo again! We dealt with Goblick before, but now it's Sharp Cask. Oh boy. What do I what do I need to be? Like level like 45 for that guy? Sharp Cask has been gloamed, frightening, terrifying stuff. But what's with all the gloam exposure? This is just a rumor, but I heard it's about developing some new piece of equipment. Equipment? They want to see what happens if they expose something to high levels of gloom. That's what they're testing out. Don't tell me, the thing that we just dragged to the Great Lighthouse. Yes, I think they're materials for them making that new equipment. Whoa, that's so damn scary. When the equipment's done, they'll be able to mass produce it. I just know it'll be stuffed in that barrel and chopped to bits. I love that music. That music's becoming like one of my one of the standouts, honestly. Looks like they're carrying out some kind of dangerous plan at the Great Lighthouse. Hey Connie. I knew the two of you would go check it out. Just try to be careful. If you somehow get back safely, you'll share some monster details, right? I would, of course, have to reward you for such valuable monster research. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, here's the question. Oh, is that the, uh, is that the lighthouse right there? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't leave. Don't go anywhere. You know, I'm like Joel when he does his intermissions where he's like, don't go anywhere. Yeah, there it is. Gulch Rock Sea Great Lighthouse. Hmm. Ah, <sighs> man. Do I go to the lighthouse, or do I do side quests? That's a tough question. This is the last great lighthouse. I'm ready to go when you two are. Oh, I might not actually go. I might actually ignore that. Recommended level is 39. Oh, that's not bad. What the hell? That's easy. I'm like on, I'm like on level with that guy. Um... Okay, there's all- so there's a fortune teller here, but where? Obviously it's not gonna tell me where. Are any of you guys fortune tellers? I mean, if I go to Lighthouse, we're not gonna get to fight all those bosses anyway. Hmm. Well, hang on. Do I have, um... Do I have Ant Berries in my inventory? I don't know. Let me, let me ask him. 
with all this hamberry food, I could treat lots of folks. Although all I'm really doing is just feeding them something. You fellows are the ones doing the real work. I'm very grateful. How about, would you like to take some ant berries? You got ten ant berries. You just get them for free, okay. Are they in my inventory now? Oh yeah, they are. That's kind of interesting. They have a they have an item specifically for curing gloom. And to my knowledge, the only enemy that's actually inflicted me with gloom so far has been Goblin DX or whatever the fuck you want to call him. Wait, hang on. Maybe the, maybe the maybe the the freaking gossiping Annies will know. Okay, that's one of them. <laughs> hmm. There might be a ghost. Okay, lower part of the island. That's gotcha. it. Well, uh, rare time I think the gossiping annies are actually useful. <laughs> but where are they? What if she's like over here or something? Luigi! Luigi, you fucking pussy! Get over here! Oh. Okay, Mario. <laughs> well, that's a sign that, th that she's in here. Ah, oh, you too! I like how her, like, head is a frickin' crystal ball, that's amazing. Hmm, I see, I see. Have you felt a little more doomed than usual? Tripped for no reason at all? Sensed someone, but there's no one. Sounds like, uh, sounds like Mario and Luigi are about to go to Silent Hill. <laughs> yes, yes, as I thought. You're both cursed. It's a nasty curse, too. This won't end well for you. Well, you can break the curse, but only if you do exactly what I say. <laughs> oh boy, Mario and Luigi's days are numbered. <laughs> a presence floats out there, far away across the waves. That which means you both ill dwells on a small island. An islet, to be more accurate, but the name. The name. Lano Islet? Mano Islet? The exact name eludes me. Go there, quickly! Root out the evil and source. If you don't, you'll meet your doom soon. Hee 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 hee. Fucking boo noise. Bros Hammer DX, ooh. Goomba. Tumbling Tower Reef. Maintaining the balance requires the talons of everyone top to bottom. But third guy is stressing out. His sinus is pressing about his, about headaches nobody had taught him. I, I love this reef. That's 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 a great reef. I love that it's just five Goombas fucking like crumbling. Oh! Oh shit! <laughs> Luigi's gonna keep, like, panicking. I don't know if there's actually a faster way to get around, but whatever. So we gotta go all the way to that island. Alright, where is Nano Island? Right over there. So do we go to do we go to like the front part of Nano Island or do we go to like the back side where we have to take the pipe? That's what I'm sh not sure about. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. All right, let's get ready. It's it's coming. Boom. <laughs> Sorry, Connie. You'll have to wait after I do all these side quests. Might even just be a side quest episode in general. 
Is this the boo right here? Oh my god, there's a fucking boo here. That's so cute. Look at him. <laughs> Just as my contact promised. Someone powerful to battle. But that she sent you two here, Mario and Luigi? I've really got to thank her. Now let's battle. Look at this little guru. Look at him. Oh yeah. He's got a lot of he brought a lot of friends with him. Dang, look at this lighting. Holy shit, this is sick. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just taking in the uh I'm just taking in the environment. Oh yeah, there's the anti zocket specialist. Again though, they only work against um It only works against uh frickin' like when you jump. Hmm. Hey, maybe I can actually take advantage of the countdown to cure this time. Alright, bomb derby time. It wouldn't be time to get a new bros attack so soon. The game is long, but they didn't compensate by making more bros attacks. They just kind of spaced them out by like eight hours each. <laughs> Got him. Alright, let's screw up these boos with the Yoohoo Cannon! I do love me, I do love me some Yoohoo Cannon, they're great. God damn it, I did it again. I fucked up. I gotta stop doing that. By the way, I, uh, I recently dumped the Rama Fest for this game. I did it, like, about, uh, I don't know, before I started the recording, and I, uh, learned something new about the game. Well, not really about the game, just more about stuff that I didn't know about, because I'm still new to, like, game engines and stuff. I'll talk about it in a bit. Hee <laughs> that was a good time! Pass my thanks to the contact if you see her. <laughs> that was a funny boo. He's contact. Mm. Mm. Let's just get back to that lady who sent us here. So, it, it's pretty known by now that Mario Luigi Brothership was made with Unreal Engine 4. Now, I don't know anything about Unreal Engine 4. I've never used it. I don't own it. Nothing like that. But apparently, all of the data for this game is stored inside of a... UCAS file, which is how Unreal Engine 4 packages its games, apparently. Now, I, I didn't know that. <laughs> so I was I was interested to find out that I can't access any of the data unless I, like, get Unreal Engine 4 or something, which is whatever. <laughs> Guess I'm not gonna be modding this game, even if I wanted to. <laughs> but... That was a bit of inter that was a bit interesting to find out. So if I really wanted to edit this game, I'd need to get me uh, Unreal Engine 4, I guess. Colorful Sea Great Lighthouse. Let's go over there. Which is uh I believe it's like right here. Yeah. I'll get that set up while I'm, uh, doing another quest. Um... Go to Slip and Glide Island. Well, I guess it tells you where you need to go anyway. Hey, I mean, if we go to the Great Lighthouse, we get, um, some more Illuminate, too, so that's nice. Not sure how much we'll get. But we'll get something. So where is this mystery person? Alright, let's go talk. <sighs> if only... If only I had a nice bonfire and some piping hot potato stew. Or hot potato stew. Ah, that wasn't what it sounded like. It was a mere jest. This island's the best. 
This coal is just perfect, just perfectly pleasing, delightful, to be sure. Oh, huh. it's just you, Mario. I was afraid everyone overheard me. Um, I'd appreciate if you didn't tell anyone, but... You see, I... as it happens... Uh, I can't deal with the cold. Hey, hold on, don't ignore me. Would you hear my story, please? I was born here on Slip and Glide Island. It was most certainly a cold day. And since that day, thanks to that cold, I'm always slipping and gliding flat on my face parts. Then my eyes mist up like frosty glass from the ouchiness of it. I have nothing out here to give me that heat but tepid puns and lukewarm metaphors. Ice cream, shaved ice. It's ice for dinner today and ice for dinner tomorrow. That was my normal. But one day I just woke up and realized... Living in the cold is horrible. Wait, don't go. <laughs> Guys, don't go. <laughs> Fuck. God damn, I hate when my soundboard does that, dude. Why does it keep fucking going? Why does it fucking keep going to my TV, <laughs> bro? Actually, wait, am I still playing out of my TV? No, I'm not. Guys, don't go. Don't leave me alone. Please, Mario, won't you hear my quest? Please, Mario, please listen to my request. Maybe if I could just discreetly make a bonfire out here, eat a little hot tato stew. That's my dream, absurd as it may be. Hot tato stew? That's a heat freeze island dish, yeah? What we need to do is get a little fire going, eh? Yeah, it's really a lot to ask. It's fine. Thanks anyway. It's a dream, and a, a dream it shall remain. Alright, well, guess I gotta go with Heat Freeze. Heat Freeze! Ooh. By the way, I got some, uh, I got some leftover, uh, Halloween chocolates. <laughs> Let's just say. And, um, they didn't have very much. <laughs> Let's just say. Um, what do we call it? They had the box of like a hundred Kit Kats, Arrows, Smarties, and Coffee Crisps. Which, uh, to, to Americans, that probably sounds crazy. Because <laughs> you guys don't have that shit. You guys don't have Coffee Crisp and Kit Kat. Well, actually, no, you have Kit Kat. You don't have an Arrow. Actually, wait, do Americans have Coffee Crisp? Oh, yeah. No, I'm starting to doubt myself. Oh. So there's a. Wait, there's a question block down there. How have I missed that this whole time? And then more importantly, how the fuck do you get over there? I don't know, I'll have to go check that out. Okay, we're at the lighthouse now. Alright, turn the sailing off so we don't get the pop-ups every few seconds. This shit's annoying, dude. It does kind of make me wonder how um, future Mario and Luigi games are going to be like. I'm really hoping this isn't a Mega Man 11 situation where we get one modern game and then we never hear from it again. Hot tail stew, you need to go, you say? You got it. You just wait a moment while I fix that up for you. Sometimes giving NPCs my normal voice isn't bad. Here you go. Straight out of the pot. As hot as it can be. Mind you, don't scald yourself on it. Yes! How the fuck are you gonna carry that all the way to the island well, before it gets cold? Bro, I, li I, leave, I leave my soup out for like 20 sec- not 20 seconds. For like a couple minutes, and then it gets fucking cold. Oh, I see. If you use your bros move... Back to Slip and Glide Island. And I do love that bros move. Speaking of bros move, I think we can go over here now. I don't think we were able to go over here before. And there's a gold medallion. And an ultra candy. The candy I wasn't even trying to get, but yeah. Okay, so there's some blocks over there that I'm not sure how to get to. I'm gonna have a look at that. 
Alright, um, yeah, because there's, there's blocks over there that I want to get to, and I don't know how to get to them. Let me, let me try that. Let me try something out. Um, oh, I'm stupid. I could have gotten these the second I got to this island. Holy shit, how did I miss that? Yeah, pipe. Cool pipe. Man, the fact that I, I, I would not, I could not imagine this game without a fast travel system now. Dude, imagine how painful it must be to do all these side quests legitimately. I'm able to, I was able to put up with it in TTYD, but oof. Man, this game, it is, it is something else, I tell ya. Yeet, yeet, yeet. Whoa, more, more. Yeah! Is that? No way! It is! Potato stew! Piping hot and delicious! Thank you so much! My dream has come true! Thank you! Here, as a token of my thanks. Ah, a warm heart and a warm body. The hot, the cold, the good, the bad. Yes, it's a world of many things, many contrasts, and that's okay. Listen to me, I let slip a few foolish thoughts there. Oh. And no one heard them! Max Syrup Jar. Alright, here we go to offhand then now. My dad's got my dad's going on about some crazy shit right now. He's going on about fucking aliens and stuff. <laughs> I don't know what the hell he's on about. It's at least entertaining, I suppose. All right, well here we are on like the one unique island in the sea. Oh, well, good thing the person we need is right here. Mario! Please help us! We've got toad trouble! Uh oh. Captured by Bowser's guys? Not yet, but they will be if we don't do something. We came here to do some undercover investigation. We wanted to follow Princess Peach's example and help out. See, I came straight to the most dangerous place you could find, eh? <laughs> what does it matter? What's that danger matter when you're helping people? Thought I'm helping heal by standing here and holding down the nice sea fort. <laughs> oh, also, our undercover infiltration was a complete success. But exfiltration's hard, you know, leaving. My friends are hiding somewhere in disguise. Can you please get them out of here? Toads undercover. Ah, oh, great, another frickin' toad mission. Just my luck, huh? Uh, and the thing is, I don't know where the fuck they are, either. <laughs> I guess we'll find out. No. 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 Fuck! You guys are goom dead. By the way, uh, I normally hate AI. But there is a really, um, interesting video that I found a few nights ago. It's the Mario Luigi Brothership battle theme, but extended with an AI. And it's basically like a what-if scenario. If, like, what if the Mario Luigi Brothership battle theme was, like, twice as long? <laughs> and honestly, it sounds kind of decent. And uh, I kind of wanted to mod it into the game. <laughs> I kind of wanted to mod it in the game secretly without you guys knowing, but... Uh, now nah, I don't think that's gonna happen now, because I can't figure out how to fucking extract, uh... Unreal Engine files. So, yeah. I'm not perfect at modding still. 
Okay, so where are those toads at? I need to keep an eye out. See, I know, I know about, I know how to deal with BFSTMs, uh, MUS3 audio, um, BEA files. Oh, well, hey, there's some toads right here. Mario, we just managed to escape, but at least one toad's still in the plaza somewhere. Okay, well, I gotta put on my disguises. I paid 15,000 studs for that, man. I gotta use it at least once. So where could this toad be? Um, is he also gonna be wearing a uh, disguise? Okay, well, he's in the plaza, obviously. Are you the toad? I heard those gents from the wanted posters escaped. It must be something special to have gone past all that jail stuff. Also, I forgot this was here. I noticed that was there in a cutscene, I forgot to grab it. Uh, oh, oh, I see him, I see him. <laughs> Hang on, let me, let me go over there. I was waiting up to say. If you want some way away show to do, you'll wait in line. Uh, you're not dim, are you? Oof, looks like we get right in the line, right, eh? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. get your bow, your brain, way away, show to dude. I heard the soda, you're so good, it turns your brain to mush. I'm really excited to try it. Way ahead of us. In line, is that? Whoa, Mario! I want to show way away soda, but so does everyone else! Hey. Unfortunately, we're all out for today, Shari dude. No way! Guess I missed my chance! Well, you weren't able to get any way away soda? Here, you can have mine! Well, how generous, dude! I just want more people to know how delicious Way Away Soda is. Here, have a sip and let me know what you think. Yahoo! Oh, it looks like that's down sm- wait. It's Luigi! Mario, you too, dude! Bro, you guys fell- f You guys made the same fucking mistake again. You got a lot of nerve coming back here, dude. And you got found out the same way again. You just don't learn, do you, dude? This time we'll get you good. <laughs> These fucking dumbass Koopas, bro. Oh, yeah. Well, no, no red Koopas. Koopas. <laughs> Koopas. How come there's no red Koopas? Man, I'm too strong for this game. Those are some dead Coopers. One Cooper lived! Get his ass. Yeah! Dead Cooper. We got a thousand experience from four Coopers. That's pretty good, huh? Oh, that was close! Thanks for saving me! Alright, now what? Do I go talk- do I go back to the entrance? Wait... Huh? I dumb- do I need to go- wait, let me- let me go talk to them first. I've learned my lesson about way away soda! Please help the other toads get out of here too. Wait, there's other toads somewhere? Where are they? I mean, at least they're easy to spot. <laughs> well, now I'm not sure. We got a flying Joseph. A Goomba. I like this little hub area. It's boomy. Um, I don't see a toad anywhere. Maybe he's over here. Oh, yeah, there he is. There's something off about you. Off? I'm as on as they come, I swear. Oh. 
Wow. Yeah, that was a close one. Thank you. You're Mario and Luigi, right? Yeah. Well, I finished my big investigation, so back I go. Alright, uh, what, is there another one over here? Oh yeah, there is. Whoa! Aren't you Mario? Yay! I go home, but this stew's too tasty! Bring some with you then! Oh no, my friends are waiting for me! Understood. I've got some info to share, so I better head back. Is that, is that all of them? Everyone's back! Yay! Why? You all made it! I'm so relieved you're all right! What was it like going undercover? Did you discover any important secrets? I found a delicious stew recipe! Wait, wait, soda has supply chain issues? Our disguises didn't work. Hmm, I see. But I did pick up some good stuff. I thought you heroes could probably use it. Oh, these are the most useless toads of all time, bro. They went in disguise themselves, and they, they found good stew, they found good soda, and they got caught. That's that's brilliant. Mario Luigi, thank you so much for your help. Well, I'll be back on ship shape. Okay. Okay. Alright, uh, report back to the ship shape lady. Oh, did you see, like, Luigi's slide there? Oh. Okay, I guess I'm seeing things. Alright, um... I suppose we can go back to Ship Shape. We have to go- we have to go back to Ship Shape to go use the cannon to go to, um... Frickin', uh... Dungeon anyway. I don't think there's really anything to do with the lighthouse. So, I might just meet you guys there, I'm not sure yet. We'll see, though. At the very least, let's go talk to the lady. Ooh. Oh, you've come back safe and sound. Ha 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 ha. I bet he gave you a good match, didn't he? He does like a good battle. Here's hoping more kind souls take the bait. <laughs> wow, <laughs> that was great. Masterpiece wear. Defeating monsters increases your BP by four. Sure. <laughs> Double damage you deal. Alright, well, away we go. We are going back to the lushful. Or the colorful sea. Wait, also, did I get this already? Did I look at this? Oh, beautiful showerfish, sea's only queen. Like the sun, her glory does shine. Skin like hers could be yours with this cream. It's a bargain at $9.99. Excerpt from reef poetry. Yeah, I like all the reefs, though. They're, uh, they're very flavorful. Yeah, so I'll meet you guys at the boss fight. Alright, here I am at the lighthouse. Um, it actually didn't take very long to get back here. But, um, because I keep forgetting that there's a freaking shortcut. <laughs> there's a freaking shortcut to the end of the dungeon. So, uh, here are my plugs. I have Countdown to Cure, which is already half done. Uh, the Anti-Gloam Specialist, which, uh, unfortunately doesn't have many uses left, but it'll be good for counterattacks. Uh, and we have auto one up and not dropping in case Mario and Luigi frickin' die, so... Yeah. <laughs> let's, let's, uh, see how badly we get our asses kicked. We are slightly more, uh, on the recommended level, so I don't know, we'll see. This might be tough, regardless. <laughs> oh. Here's the big boy. Alright, it's boss time.
Oops. That's quite a way to start off the fight. <laughs> All right, let's see how let's see how this this does. Yeah, this is gonna do some good damage. The recommended level is way is way more generous than the last one. Jojo, Dragon Ball, boom. 941, that's not bad. Oh crap, that did a lot of fucking damage, Jesus. <laughs> Alright, here, yeah, let's do you, Who Cannon. Boom. Not dropping. <laughs> we ain't dropping today, boys. Okay, but I probably should, um, I probably should heal up Luigi. Yeah, let's do that, just to be on the safe side. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Okay, it's fine. We're gonna, we're gonna get our, we're gonna get fully healed anyways in a second here. So, we're, we're nothing to worry about. I think, is the Luigi logic still gonna be in here too? I'm not sure, I guess we'll find out, right? I'm kind of indifferent towards the Luigi logic, um, the Luigi logic mechanic. Okay, um... What, what do I do here? Do I just I just hammer him until Luigi comes up with the thing? Yeah, that's with anti gloam specialist, by the way. <laughs> okay, let's see. What can we put on now? Um, I guess throw that on. Auto syrup has recharged. That's good too. Well, I mean, in this case, it's actually necessary to eat to do. Yeah. Well, you probably don't want the bombs, right? That's not gonna work. Got him. That's the only way to break his, uh, his tension. <laughs> Yeah, and that, there goes all the damage that he healed, too, so that's helpful. Um, unfortunately, uh, the bro's boost is not charging still. Oh, it's almost charged, though. I'm curious to see how much this will do. So this is gonna be critical damage. Cock this one up. Oh my god. This is this damage is freaking insane. 1198. Oh my god. Holy shit. Okay, okay. Bro's boost is back. Where is it? Let me put that on. Um Ah oh shit. I guess I'll get rid of countdown to charge. 
Let's go! Cool. He's gonna do like what, like 300? <laughs> 227, okay. 985, not bad. Okay, I got him, I got him. He's got a shield up, so... Uh, let's just do Bomb Derby. I don't know how safe this is gonna be. Oh, that's still pretty good damage right there. He's got another shield up. Yeah, there you go, Mario. <laughs> There's some BP back. I'm not paying attention to the damage, I'm just focusing on doing the Bros attack perfectly. <laughs> Alright, there's 474. Okay. Fuck. That's bad. Okay. Well, it's a good thing we have, uh... Oh, he, he's still going. Oh, no! No, 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 please, please, don't die, Luigi. Yep, yeah, auto syrup jar too. <laughs> okay, I need to put on a. Where is it? Where's the auto uh, auto ant berry? I don't think Luigi can actually. You can't do anything, can you? Like, can he? No, he can't. Okay. Wait, that counts. That's a spiky. That's a spiky thing. Okay, let's finish it off with a bang. Boom. Yeah. Boom. Okay, he's still alive. Whatever, whatever. It's okay. I am I am one hit away from dying, bro. No, <laughs> no, <laughs> fuck, dude. That was like one hit away from killing that bastard. Fuck. Oh, and here I was. I was about to pop off that I beat this guy first try. Dang it, man. Okay. Wait, he does a charge attack? Oh, crap. Well, now I can't do anything. Good use of my first turn, then. What in the fuck am I supposed to do? That is an excellent use of my first turn, holy shit. Completely wasted. Oh 
my god, it happened again, bro. Fuck's sake. And I got Gloom, too. Wow, this is- this battle is going fucking fantastic. I can't do shit to this guy now. Are you fucking kidding? I might as well just die. I might as well just fucking die at this point. I might as well just reset this boss fight. Or, no, we can auto one up. <laughs> okay, whatever. I, I guess now we can actually attack. Fine. I'll keep, I'll keep going. I'm not gonna give up then. Oh, well, I forgot which bro that was. Okay, that that's helpful. Oh, okay, so that's how you do that attack. Um, alright. What else can we throw? Oh, yeah, throw in the auto syrup. And... Um... Oh yeah, bros boost is still... is still going. Man, why not spirited item? I like how this second attempt's going shittier than the first attempt. I don't know how that- I don't know how I'm fucking up this badly, bro. Hey, at least the boss is challenging it. If I'm, if I'm not speed steamrolling him first try, at least that means there's challenge involved. Boom. God damn it, he tripped again! Okay. Oh yeah, you don't want- you don't want to jump on him. Oh, we're fucking dead, by the way. Yeah, we're actually just straight up dead. That attempt was, like, a, f a whole lot of fucking nothing. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, that was a fat- that was a fat attempt. Got him. Okay, now we actually dodged his shit first try. A61 is not bad. Don't, don't focus on trying to take, uh, trying to jump on him. Just don't focus, focus on dodging. And if you do land on him, then good. <laughs> you know. All right. So what do I want to put on now? Um, empower encounters isn't bad. Eh. I'll just put on auto syrup for now. This is why we have- this is why I bought normal-ass syrups, so that we can use those. Cool. Okay. I don't know, I wanna say this guy has like at least like 7,000 health. Um, let's use our regular syrup then on, uh, Luigi.
Wait. Do I have to attack him to get the Luigi logic to show up? Oh, that was kind of a waste. Wait, so you actually have to attack him to get it to show up? Oh, that's really stupid, actually. Also, out of curiosity, how much does Bomb Derby do to him? Oh, that is... that is actually nothing. What the hell? <laughs> How much did that do? <laughs> oh, yeah. 81 damage. Okay. Good to know I did to know I wasted my turn then. I didn't know you have to actually um I didn't know you actually have to uh, hit him for the Luigi log to show up. Oh god damn it. I'm assuming you don't want the bombs, right? I don't know, just a safe just a safe assumption. <laughs> Love those random lucky hits. <laughs> Hey, is my bros boost back up yet? Oh, still no. I still gotta wait an extra turn. you do like over a thousand damage on the regular in this game is actually amazing. <laughs> Alright. Rose boost. Is that in the attacks? Yeah, it is. I, wonder, I wish you could like favorite plugs. Can you do that? I don't think you can. Also, what will be better here? Jump helmet? You know, let's see how much jump helmet does in comparison to you who can. I want to know. We're gonna find out. <laughs> Twelve hundred. I think that actually does more than the Yu Who Cannon. Yu Who Cannon only did like nine hundred. All right, he's got a shield now. I'm gonna do a jump helmet then. It's I think it's stronger technically. Although you can is good for hordes of enemies. It's like satisfying to pull off. Wait, he's doing it again? Bro's doing it again. Well, oh, I got a lucky. Okay. Lucky! Yeah, well, Mario can't do much, so I might as well use, like, an Ultra Syrup or something. Oh, yeah. Bro's gonna heal his health back. Okay, it says voiding bombs, so yeah, you don't want to hit the bombs. I, I didn't even bother reading that. I guess there's gonna be more bombs this time. Ooh. 
close one. Got him. There's a bit of there's a bit of variety for error, thankfully. There's gonna be some good damage. I was worried the Luigi logic would make the game too easy, but in actuality, it's like an extra step you have to do to, like, make the boss even, be like, beatable. <laughs> if that makes sense. 1425. Damn, I'm so close to getting that 1500 achievement already. Oh yeah, let's see Jump Helm. It's cheaper anyway. That's some good damage. Alright, he's going purple mode now. Motherfucker. That is really that is really nasty, dude. Okay, um I guess we gotta spend this turn uh healing now. Alright, I'm gonna... I'm gonna use an Ultra Candy on Luigi, I think. Leave it to me. Oh, wait. What the fuck? <laughs> Leave it to me! <laughs> Leave it to me! I mean, Mario's coming back anyways, but still, that kinda sucks that I wasted one of those. And thank god for the auto one-up, man. <laughs> This wouldn't be near- Wait, he's literally almost dead. Okay, well, fuck me then. I just gotta land this Yuhu cannon. Boom. Okay. We beat, we beat, uh, Sharp Cask X. Basically, basically what it is. Yeah, Platinum Medallion. Oh, yeah. Dang, that was, that was really good. That was a pretty good boss, too. Man, all the bosses recently have been, like, stand out. I think, honestly, I won't lie, using the frickin', um, what you call it? The risk reward gloves has made the game so much more fun. Holy shit! Like Mario just does so much damage, but the fact that he dies in one hit, it's just so good. Cause you have to dodge. You have to dodge things. You can't just tank hits. You have to dodge shit, or else you're fucking dead. And I love that. I love that so much. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, let's go, uh... Also, there was this guy here. Finally alone. Uh, time to, time to force-feed that guy amp berries. Yeah, that, that took a sec. We've, so we've been going for an hour. I've, I've been going for a bit more than an hour because, uh... I, you know, went to the lighthouse and all that. But, uh, now that we're done there, let me get my ass back over to the actual lighthouse. Ugh. So I used a couple lamp berries in that fight. I think you're- I think I was meant to fight Goblick once I got access to the ant berries. But, I just did it without it. <laughs> Never doubted you for a moment. You beat the Gloam Sharp Cask. Tell me, what was it like? I want details. 
Absolutely incredible. Thank you so much, dudes. I can't wait to continue my monster research. Use your reward. But I'm surprised they're making Gloom equipment at the Great Lighthouse. Does that mean there's gonna be a frickin' Gloom, uh, what do you call it? What was the name of that guy? Gooey, gooey something? I don't remember. The gooey guy. Also, how is that fight gonna work? Since, uh, I don't think Shun is gonna be there. <gasps> Wiggler! A fury unquenchable, a rage that still burns, an avatar of anger and dread. But neither the horns nor the halo it earns, it wears a big flower on its head. Come on, Wigglers are not that angry, bro. They're much more friendly than that. Oh, look at that, we're already at the island. I think I'm done all the side quests now. Also, um... Let's see, is this better than the double-edged hammer? Oh yeah, it is. I mean, at this point, what's the point? Just put this on. Mario's still wearing the goblet boots DX, which are still good. Alright, so... Let's, uh... Let's sell that platinum medal I get. What, it probably sells for, like, something really lame, like 1500 Probably. Do you guys have any new gear? Um... What is Mario wearing again? Bros wear the... I guess we can get the... Well, actually, it doesn't, like, it doesn't matter, because Mario dies in one hit anyways. Alright, buy High Heel Boots DX. Buy... I guess we don't need double-edged hammers anymore. Buy double-edged hammers. Buy Master ha Piece Hammer. Buy Blunt Hammer DX. Validation Gloves. Oh yeah, right, I wanted to sell the, um... Oh, I forgot I had those beans. Let's sell the Platinum Bangle, or Platinum Medallion. 5,000! Damn! Okay, yeah, that's actually worth it, then. Lucky Charm. I'm keeping that just because... Also, they couldn't call it Lucky Charm, or otherwise they'd get sued, so... Good thing they called it Luck Charm. Oh, wow, we got a lot of beans. When the hell did I get all these? I don't remember. Alright, some defense beans. Give those to Mario and Luigi. Oh, well, I guess Mario's 69 stash got ruined, so I guess we can give him the stash beans. Alright, uh, well, I'm healed up, so... We can do, like, a little bit of the, um, the Great Lighthouse, I think. Plus, we're gonna see more of, uh, Zocket's goons, so we can maybe get started on that cha that challenge. Not channel. Oof, man, this page is looking really nice now. Oh, wait, I think these were from, uh... These are from beating the, uh... The challenges where those beans were from. I forgot I had them, honestly. Oh, this is so... This is as painful as the name. I'm so, I have 75 damage off from doing that. Man. It kinda makes me wanna go s see if I can... Get it? on uh, a regular ass enemy. All right, real quick. I wanna see if I'm gonna do 1500 damage with this. <laughs> Probably not, but I am quietly working on my, uh, I'm quietly working on my road to doing 1500 damage, <laughs> as well as, uh, working on the 300 enemies challenge as well. That basically didn't even cap 1k. That's so lame, bro. What the fuck? Well, for reference, here is my progress so far on the challenge. I need 220 left to go. I have only killed, like, maybe 15 enemies, but I am working on it, so... Yeah. Alright guys, 
It is finally time. I'm ready to get my achievement. <laughs> Boom. Alright, do it yourself. We get the last ditch gloves and some beans. Oh, yeah. I grinded this I wanna say for a few hours. I did a sh I did most of it like just now today, in the middle of this recording. So now, officially say, we have this achievement out of the way. Thank God, because this is probably the most annoying one to do in the entire game, because you have to de-equip everything and fight things. And it's not fun, but I got it over with. So that only leaves us with four, five, seven challenges left. Two of these we're gonna get, like, pretty much automatically. Um, this one, I'm almost done. I grinded some Zocket troops uh, in the uh, Lot of Coins building again. That's how I- that's, that helped me get this achievement, so these both kind of go hand in hand together. Um, this one is the same, and this one, uh, this one I may have to grind out if there's not a lot of Gloam enemies late game. We'll see. Anyways, let's put our gear back on. Um... Was we really wearing the Bros Hammer DX this whole time? I guess he was. I think that's the, I think we were wearing this this whole time. <laughs> I gotta figure out what the Bros were even wearing. <laughs> I don't remember. Uh, well, obviously the Rest Reward gloves, and I think the Quick Charge brooch. Luigi's wearing the Golden Pow, and he's wearing the Arc Scope. Which, honestly, I think it might be better if we take that off and put on something that would actually increase his stats a bit better. Increases the chance of getting a lucky. You know what? Let's put that on. What are the, So what are the... What are the... We got the gloves. The last ditch gloves. Increases stash and BP by 50% but you're KO'd if you take damage. Okay, so it's the risk-reward gloves, but for stash and BP. I see, that's interesting. <laughs> I mean, those could be- those could be funny to put on. Anyways, we're gonna head back to Ship Shape. And we're going to actually prepare for the, um, the next lighthouse. Because we basically did everything we can. I'm feeling pretty accomplished. Pretty accomplished myself right here. Although, I might do that after I make some lunch. So I'll probably do that and then come back to this recording. Yeah. HP and BP fully restored, baby. Alright. Yeah, this is gonna be great. So the bros, Mario and Luigi are still kind of uneven, but that's okay. Oh. My time is 51 hours. Hella inaccurate, obviously. My playtime's more along the lines of, uh, I want to say like 30 hours or so. Actually, no, it's more like 38 hours, but still. Anyways, we will go to the lighthouse. Okay, so I'm actually recording this, um, the day, like, a few days after, like, the first hour of footage. I, uh, I got interrupted in the middle of my recording, <laughs> and I had to go do something. And I boot up the game again, and there's this epic-looking sequence of the frickin' castle there. And, uh, I guess the extension core there, too, on the title screen. Yeah, I, I didn't know that the title screen dynamically changes. That is really awesome. Anyways, um... <laughs> do I go do I go to 50 hours and 46 minutes, or 51 hours and 57 minutes? <laughs> Good question. It's a lot of progress that doesn't get saved. I mean, thank god this game does have an autosave, though, because, I don't know, maybe there are some people that just dead ass forget to save. I'm not one of those people. I save religiously, but eh, sometimes it happens. People get too used to auto saves these days, and um, 
Yeah, they always forget to do that. Because, you know... <laughs> how do I even say it? You go enough years with autosave, you just think it's the norm. And suddenly when autosave is taken away from you, you feel like you're missing something, you know? Anyways, we're gonna do a little bit of the uh, second lighthouse. I don't think I'm gonna finish in one session. Which is a shame, because I, I think this like... Most of the lighthouses... I've like... Not finished the lighthouse in one run. But we'll see. We'll see how this goes. It depends how badly I get my ass kicked in this dungeon. But yeah, this is the Gulch Rock Sea Great Lighthouse. Uh, let me just check my other recording, which I, I, I kindly called Brothership 18A. Whenever I split recordings, I always letter them. <laughs> Alright, let's go. So, um... At the time of recording, um, I've been watching, uh, Chaka Conroy's Bowser's Insight Story playthrough, which, uh, I'm very excited to see because I remember watching his Partners in Time playthrough like it was yesterday, and now it's been, what, seven years? Also, you just get amp berries from blocks now, that's weird, <laughs> that's really weird. They add, like, one new item into the game, and it's a, it's an item to cure a status that's probably never going to show up in the series again, but... Hey, that's pretty cool. We gotta get, we gotta get all these blocks, man. This kind of remind me of the treacherous mansion in Luigi's Mansion 2. <laughs> uh, it starts out all, like, kind of broken. Uh, hello, sir. Do you have anything new? I, 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 these guys have dead ass not had anything new in a while. <laughs> Wait, what, what hammer is Luigi wearing? Oh, he's wearing the bros hammer at the end. I mean, the double-edged stuff is good. But, it, I mean... Again, it's only gonna get used when you, um... It's only gonna get used when you actually, like, attack with your hammer or your jump, specifically. Yeah, just give Mario some HP, even though it doesn't really matter. Just, just, just give Luigi everything at this point. Yeah, because if Mario's gonna be dying in one turn, the HP does not matter at all. <laughs> oh yeah, and I put the luck charm on Luigi. I'm kind of deciding... I'm not gonna... Uh, since I'm already at star rank, I'm just saying like, eh, whatever experience is just kind of whatever now at this point. So, yeah. I mean, we're pretty far into the game. Like, I think we're coming up on the end of the game soon. Because... After this, like, I think it's just that fifth island with Zocket's castle, and that's it. I don't know what else is could- I don't know what else could be in this game, I'm not sure. But... If I want to- if I want to, um... Okay, so I need to be level 43, if that's rainbow rank. So we still have, like, six levels left to go. And, uh, as for my challenges... Um, uh, obviously, the last two bros attacks are right here. Um... I still need to do 1,500 damage, which I'm working on. Uh, we, we need to kill 6 more Zok Troopers, 90 more Glow enemies, and we need 10k more coins. So we're actually getting pretty close to finishing all the challenges in this game now. That's also pretty exciting. And I'll make another save. You can never have to save too often. Normally I'd be saving over each of these save slots, but eh. <laughs> I don't really feel like it for some reason. Oh, we've, heard, we've heard we've heard this music over and over. Oh hey, an elevator! No one's around. Shouldn't there be gods after us? So, oh. well, my my theory is that um, Zocket probably like has he probably wants all his troops um like readying up at his castle. I don't know. <laughs> But, 
the suspenseful music tells me that there's probably going to be some dangerous guys around. The elevator's probably gonna break or something, I don't know. Wait, this is in the top floor, is it? It's starting to come together. Busy, busy. Where's things? Where's this part go? Gotta be on the ground. Hurry, hurry. No dawdling. We have to keep pace with the work at the other great lighthouses. They're preparing. Uh, they're preparing the next uh, X boss for me. Heading underground. Be careful carrying the special equipment. Okay, well, well, technically our elevator stopped, it's just not in the way I thought it would. I saw a question mark block over here, I want to get that. Boom. Wow, a regular mushroom. Oh, damn, we're like fighting them around the elevator. <laughs> That's kind of wild. Bomb Dory is just my go-to when wiping out hordes of enemies. <laughs> oh my god, I do so much damage, bro. I'm OP. Honestly, I think Rainbow Rank might actually end up helping to forgetting the uh, painful blow challenge because if my bros attacks do like 20 to 30 percent more damage, the that'll actually be really helpful. <laughs> boom! 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 We're gonna get that achievement like right away now. Yeah, I'm gonna just spike ya. Oh yeah, and since I uh, took a... I think I took a couple days off from uh, playing Brothership to work on Down Bad Edition as well. Hey, look at that, we got some items. I'm finally starting on Chapter 7, for real. <laughs> I just have to work on the Junior Troopa fight. Although by the time this comes out, I'll probably have dated myself. I don't know where I'll actually be out. Because I'm uploading one Brothership episode a day, so probably by the time I, this comes out, it's gonna be like two. It's gonna be in like two or three weeks since I played this. <laughs> probably. But either way, yeah, Chapter Seven is being worked on. Right as of right now, Zach's only finished. Uh, he he. I don't actually know. Well, last time we did uh, Down Bad Edition. He was fighting Lava Piranha, which is, uh, like, kind of a difficulty spike in terms of bosses. <laughs> so, curious to see how that'll go. You know, I kinda... I kinda liked that the first lighthouse had, um... Like, random-ass Mario and Luigi Dream Team enemies, and now all the lighthouses since then have just... That frickin' Zocket guys. It's a bit lame, but whatever. <laughs> I feel like I've leveled up enough to the point where I probably could get that 1500 damage. Alright, I just, I just killed all the goons. Um, so we're on 2F. Let me guess, there's just gonna be like five or something different floors where I gotta kill a bunch of goons? That'd be funny. This is the third floor. This isn't the top floor either. Ah. Even Bowser's edge critters get more violent, glum scary stuff. Damn. 
we got some fishy boop. We got some angry fishy boopkins here. If we get more of them glowing, they should be able to knock out those red and green guys. And we use one problem to solve another. Lord Zark is so smart. Hey. Oh, perfect timing. Go fight these guys. Alright, we gotta fight Gloam Fishy Boopkins. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See, now, if this had the, um... You know what? Just for shits and giggles. Let's use this. Let's use the clock out blow. Boom. Yeah, we're doing a lot of damage now. Oh, boy. He just, he, just, he just hits these guys so many times. Oh my god, 418. 1100. Honestly? It's kind of tempting. It's kind of tempting to, um... Oh shit. Oh bro, I hate when he does that. I hate when he does like the reverse one. Leave it to me! Leave it to me! Part of me kind of want. Oh shit, I need to heal Mario's fucking FP now. Or BP, rather. Bro, I want to see if I can get the 1500 damage right now. But that's gonna be really hard. <laughs> Here, let's, uh. Let's get rid of this guy's shield. Well, you actually have to hit it twice to get rid of it. That should get rid of his shield. No, he just bring he just puts the shield back up again. Okay, well here's what I want to do. I want to put on Bros Boost. But I think I still have that, right? Yes. And we're gonna have Mario use um clock out blow. And we're gonna see if we can do a, we're gonna see how much damage we can do with clock out blow now. I'm very curious about this. Mario does so much damage, bro. Yeah, come on. Boom. Yeah, we did it. We got it! 1500! Yeah, let's go! Oh, yeah. Notice how that one came, like, really soon after, um, getting the first painful blow. Ah! Huh? What happened? Yeah, what a shame. You knocked the loneliness right out of them. Not them before, but to beat uh, you, you ourselves. Alright, let's go. And there's an actually correct number of you this time. <laughs> okay, I gotta take off the bros boost, though. Unfortunately, all I can do is the egg move for now. Boom. I mean, it still does a decent damage. Alright, I gotta heal Mario's BP after this. <laughs> I'll do that. Oh yeah. So, me and Mario were laughing at fucking... Whoops. Cocked it up again. Oh shit, I'm dead! That auto one up's getting a lot of use, I guess. <laughs> That's what I get for cocking it up. Oh man, I'm out of charges now. Thing is, I might have needed that for the boss. We were laughing at the oh yeah Mario time. 
that Kevin Afghani did back in like like a while back. And he 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 was he was just like so disgusted. It was hilarious. All right, let me heal properly this time. I have all these random ass items. All right, we got more beans. Got any beans? Um. Eh, yeah, give one of each of them, I suppose. Actually, I'll give Luigi three, there you go. And now, um... Yeah, just buff up Luigi. Okay, so now the next challenge is... Yeah, that's pretty much what I expected. Do 2,000 damage with one or more attacks. Or just one attack. So this will probably be a gold medal with a POW on it. Up front belt. Well, whatever that is, that must be decent, right? So yeah, only five more achievements left. And this one will just come as we go through the game, so... Yeah. So the Gloam Enemy. Gloam Enemy is half done. It's just very situational to even find the Gloam Enemies to begin with. Which is, you know, kind of a problem. <laughs> with how infrequent they, uh, they are, you know? I don't know, this will kill us, find out. Boom. It did not kill the fishy boopkin. Very sad. Alright, get him. Oh, he did not die from that? Dang, okay. Yeah, those gloam shields are actually pretty annoying. You have to hit them a few times to even get rid of them. Alright, Linguini, you got this. Honestly, I don't know how much health he had left, but whatever. <laughs> These guys get pretty good experience, too. <laughs> Alright, something I forgot to do is I forgot to put on more plugs. Um, put on the speedy recharge. Put on coin flyer. Um... Get the countdown to cure readied up, I suppose. But don't forget to take it off when before you're about to fight a boss. <laughs> That's the thing. What was that interaction? <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, countdown the countdown below is more useful for bosses. At least that's just my opinion. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Man, I can't wait to see the Brothership Bestiary when that comes out. <laughs> that's gonna be exciting. Probably by the time we get to Rainbow Rank is when we're gonna be able to, uh... That'll probably be when we were able to get that 2,000 damage achievement, I don't know. So, do you just have to kill all the enemies to go up the elevator? I'm assuming that's how that works. I mean, I'm gonna do that anyways, regardless if that's what I'm supposed to do, I'm gonna kill all the enemies because I want the XP. Okay, so there's a fourth floor. How many frickin' floors are there? Still not the top floor? Is this elevator broken? Ah, uh, time for a reading break. That's a lot of memos. Which one should I read? You're not supposed to read those. Are these all Lord Sockets? Yeah, he said get rid of them when you're done. Come to the fortress. Didn't he also say something like almost time for the rebirth? I don't know why these bozos even follow his orders. Surely they see something in him. I don't know, though. Alright, he's got- You know, I'm surprised we don't have an experience up, uh, 
Clog yet. I really feel like that's something that we should have had by now, but I guess not. Oh man, that's something that tells me that the last Clog is gonna be something really lame that I won't even need. Which is kind of what I'm sad about. <laughs> It's gonna be like get plus ten plus like plus ten percent more experience from battles, and it's like wow. Knowing this game, that's how that's gonna go. Oh, Patriarch's note four. I think we have all the notes now. If I got hit by this gloom ray, would I stop caring about my son? I get that Zocket wants to make the world lonely, but I don't understand why. He sure likes talking to his egg, though. Maybe he enjoys parenting it. Wait, who is that? No, it can't be. The text is scrambling, it's hard to read the rest. Seems like they realized something important. Okay, I think, oh wait, there's one more goon. Aha, I finally first strike you, you ass swipe. Well, that's gonna make killing these bozos easier. Bozo. Yeah, I'm gonna, we're gonna get to the, we're gonna get to the end of the game, and the beast here is gonna start saying like, "Oh, this Zok member has a thousand HP." <laughs> yeah, this which is gonna be very funny. <laughs> all right, I, I killed all the bozos. <laughs> I might actually do this entire dungeon in one uh, one session, I don't know. I mean, how many floors could there possibly be, right? What if there's like 10 floors? <laughs> oh, this looks like the top floor to me. We made it, the top floor. This great lighthouse is smaller than the other, so it's not useful as a base. Really? Wait a sec. No, never mind, we need to hurry. Sorry, I'm a bit overwhelmed with everything right now. Bowser's minions got gloomed, and now they're after us. Right, and something's happening at Fortress Socket. Oh, it's a fortress, not a castle. Whatever, same thing. Hey, alright. Let's, let's light the lighthouse now, okay? Hmm. I don't know, man. Something just doesn't feel right. It really, it really doesn't. I felt that was way too easy, and that didn't take very long at all. I, gu I guess we're just done. We're just done the lighthouse? I was just expecting, like, I don't know, like, a bird is gonna come out of the sky and just, like, knock the fucking can out of Connie's hands. <laughs> he's, gonna, he's gonna start making- he's gonna start making the fucking bird up noises. Or, I don't, I don't know where it is. But yay, we get more wholesome Connie. Easiest lighthouse ever. <laughs> I fought a few goons, and that's it. Oh? Yes! No, I'm, I'm still, like, not sure if that's- if it's gonna- if it's that easy. Why'd they make the fourth lighthouse so easy? Oh, maybe, m maybe on the way back, there's gonna be something, I don't know. We did it! And now it's nighttime. That's a cool set piece, honestly. Oh, you can see his fortress in the background. We're gonna go kick that motherfucker's ass! Oh, yeah. Some fucking rice. 
Go to Fortress Zocket and stop the gloom. Wait, actually? You can see Fortress Zocket just beyond that new current. Yeah. You're going, right? I mean, duh. Thank you. Mario, Luigi, save us all from the terror of Gloam. Wait, are we actually just straight up going there? Hmm. Well, I guess we should go, um, use the cannon first. No side quests or either. Hmm. I don't know, man. I'm getting my suspicions. <laughs> Oh, wait, hang on. Uh, let me go to this new current real quick. There. We gotta, we gotta make our way over there. Look at all this. Look at all this sea we've opened up. There's an undiscovered island here. Oh. <laughs> what? Why is it just there? Huh? <laughs> I'm pumped to charge in the fortress socket. Wait, that ass? We're just going there? Nah, it can't be that easy, bro. What the hell? There's gotta be some sort of buildup. Oh. Wow, we're, we're just here. Damn. It looks freaking awesome, though. Oh, yeah, we gotta save Bauer Jr. Ooh, very, very end game. Okay. Um, I'm gonna probably split the episodes here, though. Because, um, I want to start fresh in a Fortress Zocket, so, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next episode. We're gonna, we're gonna do this place, I guess.